Hi, in this video, I'm going to answer the following email from a user. And the email says, I'm interested in investing in Nucor, but right now the stock is overvalued. Is there a way for me to get notified when a stock becomes undervalued without having to check it every day in the platform? And the short answer is yes, absolutely, you can do this. And I'm going to show you how to do that right now. So I'm logged in to the platform. And just very quickly, I'm going to click right here at the top where it says 12 rules SI criteria. Okay, so the email from the user is referring to rule number 11B. Okay, and this is part of our 10 SI criteria, rules 5 to 11. Okay, so 11B looks to see if a stock is undervalued, priced low, or overvalued, priced high. And so the way we determine if a stock is priced low is we compare the current dividend yield must be higher than the stock's average dividend yield. Okay, so we do this using the five-year average, the 10-year average, the 15, and the 20. So in this video, I'm going to use the 20-year average, and that's the default uh, for all of the values, uh, the default that we use in the platform. Okay, so the current dividend yield must be higher than the stock's average 20-year dividend yield, and then a stock is undervalued. So let's take a quick look at the stock that was mentioned in the email. So I'm gonna do a quick search here. I clicked on search stocks, typed in the stock symbol. We can see Nucor Corporation here. And we can see immediately that the stock is overvalued. So it's priced high. So now is not a good time to be owning this stock. If you scroll down, you can see it in the stock table right here it's still, it's overvalued, so not a good time to buy right now. In the user's email, the user is interested in eventually investing in this stock, and rightly so, they only want to invest in it when the stock becomes undervalued, and assuming it passes the remaining 10 SI criteria rules. So uh, we can see here the other failure is the PB ratio, so that also has to come down. Okay, so let's go ahead and show you how to do that. So you don't need to log into the platform every single day, search for the stock, you know, to check this. You could if you wanted to, it's just uh, time consuming. If you were doing it every day for let's say five, 10 or 15, 20 stocks that you're following. So the quickest way to do that is to go here to my alerts. Okay, so I'm gonna create an alert and the platform is gonna send me an email when the company becomes undervalued. So step one, I'm gonna enter in the stock symbol. So Nucor Corporation. Step two, I'm gonna add the condition. So there's 120 different columns that you can select from. So I'm gonna look at undervalued. So here we go. And so you can see we do it based on five-year data, 10, 15, 20. So I'm gonna do it based on 20-year data. Is the stock undervalued or overvalued? So I'm going to go ahead and click on that. Equal to. And we want the stock, we want to be notified by email when the stock becomes undervalued. So I'm going to click on step three is to save. You can add more conditions if you like, but for now this is all we need. Click on save. Okay, if we scroll down, we can see right here at the very last row, there is our stock. And here is the condition. When the condition is equal to undervalued, I will get an email and it's gonna notify me and then I can take action after that. Okay, that's it for this video. If you have any uh, further questions, feel free to send me an email, info at simplyinvesting.com. Thanks for watching.